Welcome to Paris Nice 2020. It's individual time trial day on stage four, just over 15 kilometers to cover around saint amand mont -Rand, the birthplace of French star Julien Alaphilippe. A tricky technical course that should give us a clearer idea of the riders who can realistically target overall victory at this 78th edition. Thomas de Gendt set in the early time to beat 19 minutes and 4 seconds. The Belgian was third in the individual time trial at last year's Tour de France, behind Alaphilippe and Geraint Thomas, though he has never won a time trial. Richie Port won time trials at Paris Nice in the two years that he won the race, 2013 and 15, but the 35 year old's in a supporting role this year for Vincenzo Nibali, who was 34 seconds off the pace. The big guns are starting to roll down the ramp. Nardo Quintana and home hopeful Alaphilippe have lost a bit of time this week. Plenty of work for them to do between now and Sunday to drag themselves back into contention. Victor Campenarts, the world hour record holder and a two-time European champion in this discipline, but the Belgian was unable to unseat his compatriot de Gent four seconds down. The Lotto Sudal man looking strong, but he was finally knocked off his perch by the Danish champion Kasper Asgreen. The De Koenig quick step man going just 0.8 seconds quicker than De Gent, with his teammate Alaphilippe some 24 seconds further back. How about this though from another Dane, Soren Krau Andersen? The Sunweb man going fully 12 seconds clear of his compatriot Asgreen, top of the leaderboard. Only one man looked like he might go faster, race leader Max Schachmann, who was quickest at the intermediate checkpoints. The German road champion making the most of the yellow jersey effect. In the end, he couldn't quite overhaul Crow Anderson, but nevertheless extended his overall lead. A solid day for Denmark then. After Asgreen got the better of De Gent, Crow Anderson stormed to his first individual time trial win of his career. The Great Dane also won World Championship gold with Sunweb in the team time trial in 2017. The winner of Paris Tour 2018, now up to second overall at Paris Nice 2020. Yeah, I'm super happy, uh, to be honest, a big relief and uh, finally it came, my TT victory. I almost can't believe it, but I was really aiming for it and uh, I, I did my best and my legs, they were they were good again, so I'm really happy. Yeah. Crow Anderson and Schachmann, the only men to go under 19 minutes and the race leader was the only serious GC contender to finish in the top 10 with home favourite Alaphilippe 36 seconds off the pace. Schachmann's closest serious challenger is the Colombian champion Sergio Higuita in fifth, with Dylan Turns and Tish Bunut also wants to watch Nibali 1 minute and 18 off the pace. Well, due to crashes and crosswinds, we've yet to have a normal bunch sprint this year, but there will be another opportunity for the fast men on Thursday. A rolling fifth stage between Ghana and La Côte Saint-André, the longest of this edition at 227 kilometres with four categorised climbs. Do join us for that one tomorrow and thanks very much for watching.